and welcome in this video we're looking at the foot centurions Baradi, who has just dropped as an objective today on friday the 13th of january as you can see he's been awarded the centurions card for scoring 100 Serie A goals for Sassuolo, which is a fair achievement for a player. It's also had a few Italian caps along the way. Um, the card itself is an 87 rated right midfielder. He's a one of those cards that is a left-footed player on the right wing. And he's got a three-star weak foot, so you can use him a little bit on his right. But obviously he will prefer to stick to his left. Five-star skill moves means that he will be useful as a winger. Um, but he only has that one position, so you can't put him right wing or centre midfield. He's just a right mid, and that's where he's staying. As you can see with the card, he's fairly good, well-balanced all the way around, quite similar to the, jo uh, the Joachim um, Real Betis right midfield card. High aggression, good stamina, fairly well-rounded dribbling. The passing is good, the finishing is the shooting generally is good and the pace is uh, pretty solid as well. Um, some variations on the chem cards you could use here. You could go Hawk to boost that strength a little bit more. You could concentrate on the pace and the shooting. You could go elsewhere with the reactions and just the dribbling aspects of his card. It's entirely how you want to play the game. Which players you find that you easiest and best to use within the game you get the results with. He's got three traits of use, two traits of use outside of foot shot trait and flair. The team player one isn't that applicable within normal um, ultimate team. So it's a free card because it costs you four segments to do so. As you can see, the first one, scoring genius. Score eight goals using Serie A players on squad battles on minimum semi-pro difficulty or rivals. So you can do it while qualifying for the weekend league. You can do it through your normal rival stuff. Or you can purposefully go into squad battles and do it specifically through there. But it doesn't matter whether you win, lose or draw the match. It doesn't matter if you do it in one game or 20 games. As long as you score those eight goals, that's all that counts. Um, and you get a 75 plus rated rare player for completing that first segment. Second one up is midfield touch. Assist four goals using midfielders. So that's left midfielder, right midfielder, central midfielder. Central defensive midfielder and central attacking midfielder. Centre forwards do not count. Right wingers and left wingers do not count. Only ones with midfield in their names. And again, doesn't matter if you win, lose or draw the match. You can assist four goals with midfielders and lose 22-4. Doesn't matter. You'll still tick off those four. You'll still get the goal pack as the achievement. The third one up is highlight play, score and assist, score and assist using an Italian player in three separate matches in squad battles on minimum semi-pro difficulty. You get a small two rare gold players pack for this because it's going to cost you three matches of your time to do so. Um, again, you don't need to win, lose or draw the match. doesn't matter which one you do as long as you score and assist using an Italian player. In those three separate games. And the fourth one up is the one that actually counts. Win six matches in squad battles on minimum semi-pro difficulty or rivals. And you get a small electron players pack for that. So technically you could just take an Italian or a Serie A based squad into some rivals games. And you can complete this accidentally without even trying. Just the way it is. Um, but... These four all give a small pack in return and you get an 87 rated card at the end if you want to use that card, if you want to trade in that card. Um, if you want to use it in an SPC or something like that, it's entirely up to you, but you will get that card if you complete those objectives. The squad that I'm going to be using for this um, is my Serie A based team, which is this. We have two Italians up front, so that will help with the score and assist with an Italian in the game. Um, four midfielders, all qualifying as midfielders, and then just a normal back line and a keeper that I've only got the one keeper in the Serie A uh, league. Got some other options on the bench, but to be honest, it's rivals or squad battles on semi-pro difficulty, so I don't think I'll need that. Um, that's what we got. Um, the Politano is really good with all his traits, and the player of the month, Keen, is really good as well. Lots of 90 rated odd stats for him. It's a decent card to use in the game. So that's the squad that I will use. Good luck getting your Domenico Berardi. Um, should all register as normal. Hopefully, there aren't any problems with the processing of this card and the objectives. 
other than that, I will see you in the next video. I wish you well. Good luck with your packs, with your picks, and what you get out of rewards. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.